Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. I am so excited to be a part of the planning process for worship this year at annual conference and to be invited to coordinate that is not only an honor but quite humbling and quite a daunting task. It has been a joy to work with our director of music Matthew Wenzel as we've been preparing worship along with others on the committee. But some of the things that we're really excited about uh, is the opportunity to uh, focus in on traditional music uh, as we uh, do our celebratory things while at the same time incorporating and blending worship up some uh, with some of the best of the music of our contemporary uh, praise and worship culture. Additionally, we're really excited about the opportunity to offer a, a, a new hymn this year as we close our opening celebration, which will, uh, which will describe our journey for us and the bishop's call for us as an annual conference to be alive together in Christ. And that's exciting. And the bishop, with his, uh, with his vision for our conference, we look forward to living into that. So we'll be starting that alive together journey this year at annual conference and continue um, understanding our journey of faith. Uh, as, as we work through the conference. And we're excited also about uh, the opportunity to, uh, to remember our brothers and sisters who are no longer with us but with the Lord. And that, that memorial service is going to be a wonderful time for us to reconnect uh, together as we celebrate communion and as we remember the lives of these men and women who served among us. One of the things I'm, I'm especially excited about this year is the opportunity to uh, collect stoles from our clergy folks um, and as each deceased clergy person is read we're going to take a stole and yoke it uh, upon an oxen yoke uh, to remember uh, that person who is no longer with us and then uh, the oxen with the yoke uh, why that will be a part of our um, great thanksgiving and the celebration of communion that night as we are all remembered to God's table and again, the night on Friday night when we have the ministry celebration uh, looks to be exciting as well as we focus this year more on our retirees and uh, the journeys that they've taken through word, sacrament, order, and service. It's not to be taken lightly, and we are so thankful for their service. And so for the opportunity to plan all of this, uh, well, it's been daunting, but absolutely exciting and invigorating, and I'm looking forward to being a part of sharing that vision with you at the 2013 Susquehanna Annual Conference. Blessings.